everyone. So this is um, just a collective drugstore haul. Let me just adjust the camera a little bit. All right. So I'm just going to do this really quick. Um, a lot of it I did get from a Soompi seller, um, but you can obviously get these from a drugstore brand, uh, drugs, any drugstore. I just got some of these for a little cheaper price. Um, they were brand new. But I'm going to start off with something that I got a while ago, and it's from Ulta. And this was when they still had a NYX sale going on. So I really wanted the NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk, which is the white one. Um, and they were having a buy two, get one free sale. So I just bought the white um, oh, lavender color. So let me just do a swatch for you first. The Milk. Um, it's a very, very pigmented white color, which is perfect. And then this is the... Um, a lilac type color and it's in lavender. There you have it. The lighting's not that great today. And then this nice pink color in strawberry milk. I don't know if you can see that pink, but yes. That is what I got. Um they were $4.49 each, but then it was buy two get one free. Um Oh, and hold on. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh, by the way, sorry my room's like more emptied and like kind of packed. Um, I am starting to move out, so if you follow me on Twitter, you'll notice that. Um, also, another thing I got from Ulta is this China Glaze nail polish, and I think it's so pretty if you can just see the glitters um, and this was on clearance sale for $2.99 um, then the whole um, like I had a three dollars and fifty cents off of a ten dollars or more purchase so my whole total came out to nine dollars for all those um, I feel like this is such a pretty color oh and this is in Midnight Mission by China guys and I also joined the uh, club at Ulta, I feel like their rewards are a lot better than Sephora's. I mean, Sephora, if you spend like $500, you get a little little deluxe sample or whatever. But at Ulta, you can, if you spend like even $300, you can get like a perfume and stuff. You just have all of these great things. Um, so I definitely like it more at Ulta. Um, unfortunately, I can't go to Ulta all the time because it is like out of my way to go there. Sorry, this is a piece of hair. Alright, so that is all that I got from Ulta. Then the next thing is I got a few things at Walmart. Um, this is some a disappointment. I wanted to try out the hard candy box in a box, and look what happened. It broke. It came in the mail. I ordered it online because I had a few other things. Um, so I'm just going to return it, and the color didn't seem too appealing to me anyway. And there's not a whole lot of product in there if you look. So... Although it looks like a big huge box, it's just it's just the packaging. And that was six dollars. Um and then sorry, there's it's allergy season, so it's been driving me nuts. My favorite thing right now from Walmart that I got is this hair straightener. Um I'm one of those people that hate when wires get all tangled and like messy. This is my solution. Um it's a retractable cord. There's a button on the side to um, retrieve the cord, which I think is awesome. Um, this is one, one eight, 1875 watts, or 1875 watts. So it's not bad. Um, it has your typical buttons, and this was $25. It's not bad. Um, then I also got this, and uh, my USB cord is like tangled. This is my uh, new kind of toy, I guess, kind of, not toy, but I've been playing around with it because um, I really like ha having curly hair for special occasion. Um, this is the Infinity by Conair, and I like how this doesn't have the uh, the snap, you know, the, the one that clips your hair onto it because it does kind of leave a dent. Um, I don't like that. And it's actually really, really hot, so I only use the lowest setting. Um, it's 310. I don't use the highest. But this was $30, $29.95 at Walmart. And the funny thing is I was going to get these at CVS. 
and I actually bought the hair straightener at CVS but it was like $42 um, then I saw it at Walmart.com and I decided to return the one at CVS um, and just get it at Walmart and they were selling this hair curler the same the exact price for $42 so I saved a lot just by going to Walmart they didn't have it in my store so I went to the website alright and since we're at Walmart they also gave me like a bunch of samples like these are really good size samples and I was just like oh wow that's really nice of them they gave me a Garnier Fructis anti-dandruff shampoo um, and like coupons in the back and they also gave me Garnier Fructis uh, triple nutrition ooh sorry just like totally pushed my camera um then they also gave me Dove. Oh, these are both conditioners. I don't know, I guess they have a lot of shampoo and stuff. Um, I don't know what this oil control lotion by this brand. John Frieda full repair shampoo and conditioner. <laughs> they also gave me a pack of these. And the thing I really like is they gave me Frederick Fakai. And it came in this nice little packaging. I love Frederick Fakai. I already used their glossing cream, so this is nice. Um, this is just their glossing shampoo and conditioner. I like how this one's like all fancy compared to the other ones. It's just nice. And also they gave me... Um, hard candy take me out liner a little mini sample of it so I was like oh that's cool it's there's like glitters in this liner though so I don't know if I'll actually use it but yeah so that was that all right then like I said I got some things from the Soompi seller and all these products are actually like drugstore products so um I don't remember what I showed you guys before and what I didn't so I'm just gonna like if I showed you this before I'm sorry all right um I already have one of these it's the Milani liquify eyeliners um in black but this is just my backup and I paid like five dollars for this and then I also got a Linear um, Intense Carbon Black Felt Tip Eyeliner, Liquid Eyeliner by L'Oreal, and this was $4. Like I said, I got it from Snoopy Seller, so they were selling it for cheaper. Um, you definitely, you have to pay like $10 at a drugstore for this, so. Then I also got the Volume Express Mascara, the Falsies Mascara, in very black. And this was $5. And, alright. So I got four of these Revlon glosses, and I'm absolutely in love with them. Um, these are this, what do you call them, Super Lustrous? I believe these are the Super Lustrous glosses. Um, so I got these colors, and this one is in, let's see, Pink Pop. It's a very vibrant pink color. This one's right now my current favorite. Um, I'm actually wearing this on top of my Pink Please by Maybelline. Um, and this is Coral Reef. It's a nice, vibrant coral color. And this is Peach Petal. I like this. It's a very nice, muted, nude pink color. Um, and then this is the one that kind of speaks out for itself. This is um, in, what is it called? Lilac Pastel. So I'm going to just do some swatches since I'm at it. Alright, that's Lilac Pastel. I don't know if you can tell, a little purple right there. Um, it is kind of a little bit more sheer than the other colors. Alright, and this one is Pink Pop. It def I love how these are so pigmented for lip glosses. Um, I guess compared to other lip glosses, they're not very pigmented. Like the, I compare them to my um, Makeup Forever ones, and those ones are very sheer. And that one right here... This is the peach petal, and of course, one of my favorites right now is the coral reef. Look how vibrant those colors are. 
That's just awesome. I love it. Okay, and also the Volume Express 1x1 one one mascara in black is black. Um, this I didn't get from a Snoopy seller, I got from CVS. Um, but Maybelline was having like some kind of a sale, so. And now for the Maybelline eyeshadows. Um, like I said, this was in my favorites video. I've been loving this. I have this on right now. And this is the Natural Smoke Squad. I just love the colors. I think they're they're really, really nice. So these are just some swatches for the Natural Smoke Squad. I like this and the Chai Latte. I don't, I don't like the um, Emerald Smokes and uh, Charcoal Smokes because I've tried those before and those are just not my favorite. And then the three other quads that I'm really excited about is these um, Eye Studio Quads. And this one is in Give Me Gold. And I got these palettes for $4. Um, Copper Chic. And Irresistibly Ivy. Yeah. And let me just... I'm not going to do swatches of all of them just because. But I guess it's a hit or miss on these type of things because some people's reviews weren't that, like, great. But look how pretty this color is. And this is part of the squad. I, I mainly got it for that color. It's just so pretty. Um, so... That is all for my drugstore haul. I hope you guys like this. Um, I will definitely be doing a top 10 or top, I don't know, whatever, top drugstore products um, that I personally like sooner or later. I'm just still working on using all of them, so I already have a few favorites, but yeah, that is pretty much it. And thank you so much for watching. Bye!